Hey guys! For today's video, we are going to introduce to you the group 11B of the periodic table of elements. The group 11 elements include copper, silver, gold, and uranium. Group 11B is also known as the coinage metals due to their former usage. Example of copper are copper bars. It is used in power generation, power transmission, power distribution, telecommunications, electronic circuitry, and countless types of electrical equipment. Copper and its alloys are also used to make electrical contacts. One of the least reactive chemical elements and is solid under standard conditions. Gold often occurs in a three elemental liquid form as nuggets or grains, in rocks, in veins, and in albumin deposits. Less commonly, it occurs in minerals as gold compounds, often with thallium or gold thallium. The best example of gold is in jewelry because it is the largest single use of gold. Characteristic of gold, gold can be drawn in a monoatomic wire and then stretch more before it breaks. Since gold, silver, and copper is found in nature, there is still one metal that is artificial made. Do you know what it is? Lastly, the mercury. It is a radioactive synthetic element and is, it is named after Wilhelm Conrad Mengele. He is the one who discovered x ray Unlike copper, silver, and gold, Mengele is a magnet element. So, you need to According to the Institute for Heavy Ion Research in Germany, 
Ruventinium is a super heavy element. Wilhelm Conrad Röntgen recognized X-rays as a unique type of rays with special properties. Ruventinium itself, however, has no commercial application and much remains unknown about its properties due to its extremely short half-life. At present, it is only used in research. The most stable isotope is 281 Rg with a half-life of about 26 seconds.